This is Wilman Ziada, New York City-based director and creator of theater, television, and film. And today I am thrilled to be speaking with guitarist and music producer, the one and only Matt San Giovanni. But before we get to our interview, here's a sneak peek at Matt's incredible talent, playing a song from Dear Evan Hansen alongside the amazing vocals of his partner, Maria Wearies. <laughs> Well, hello, Matt. How are you? I am good. Good to be here. Matt, so nice to be here with you as well. I literally just had an interview with someone in Korea, and here we are speaking only blocks away from one another in New York City. I love the fact that we know so many amazing people in common in this great biz of show. I want to know first and foremost, Matt, specifically regarding the guitar, because obviously it's the bedrock of all of the different instruments that you play, which include, you know, the banjo, the mandolin, the ukulele, to name a few. Mm -hmm. How old were you when you got that first guitar? And what is it about the instrument that you think you fell in love with? Wow, I mean, yeah, I didn't actually, I didn't start playing guitar until I was 14 in high school. Um, I started doing it it was like an elective course in my high school to just like, you know, go to and practice guitar every day. And just throughout the course of that year, I just like really started to just love the instrument and all the different things you can do with it. You know, compared to some other instruments, it's, it's really one of the only instruments where it's like, you can play rhythm, you can play melody, you can play chords, you can make all kinds of crazy sound effects, you can, bend notes which is just a purely uniquely guitar thing um it's so expressive and so so it can be so beautiful and also just so like raw and cool all at the same time and i don't know i just love it well i mean and also in terms of the other instruments that you play within the guitar family what do you like most about for example i mean you know the, between the banjo the mandolin the uke i mean obviously they all have their own different sensibility and texture to it. Is there one guitar instrument or is it like picking a favorite baby? I mean, is there one in particular you love to play? You know, I honestly, I people love to, to hate on it and make fun of it, but I love playing the banjo so much. Like, um, I mean, I love bluegrass music. I love the, the twangy silliness of the whole thing. And just like, it's just so much fun to play banjo. And it is, it's like guitar, but it's also got its, completely different realm of technique with like the finger picking and like all that kind of stuff and yeah I have I actually have two banjos back there on the wall um, but I, I definitely love the banjo probably more so than the mandolin or the ukulele I and love then... it I won't tell the other instruments Matt <laughs> listen I want to also know you know obviously you've you've already had so young such an amazing career especially touring with Tony award-winning musicals such as Dear Evan Hansen and Kinky Boots. How did you get involved in the theater world? I did. I wasn't super involved with it until my like last year and a half at college. I was at Berkeley College of Music and I had played for like one or two musicals before for my high school, but then I auditioned for Berkeley's musical theater ensemble orchestra as like an elective ensemble class. And just through the course of doing that in this like really professional and awesome setting, putting on these shows, it just 
it really ignited the fire for me. We were doing the show we the first show we did was Illegally Blonde, which is just a show I can't say enough about. I love it so much. It's so much fun, especially as a guitarist, you get to play all these different styles. And I'm not really a songwriter so much. Like I, I'll produce music and I'll arrange music, but I don't usually sit down and like write out lyrics and you know craft a story. But being able to play through all these different styles and other people's musics and just have a whole journey from start to finish every night, it's just like, it really got a hold of me. And so since then, it's basically like, it was my main focus is like, this is it, this is what I wanna do, which is musical theater all the time. I love it. Well, I'm with you too, not playing the guitar, but you know, musical sure. theater all the time. God bless. That's why I'm so blessed I get to paid for a living to direct. Why they keep hiring that, I don't know. But I will say this, I'm so excited for all that you have done. I know what you have coming up. I can't wait to meet you. I would love to work with you one day. I want to let our audience know, though, for more on the amazing Matt, you can read more about him right below this video. And Matt, I'm so excited you're coming on board this exciting new social media app, Phoenix360. And on top of that all, again, I'm just happy we're connected now. We live blocks from one another. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. I'm, I'm really psyched about it. Nice to meet you. You too.